Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Eddie Marcus. One more time. Look, I'm here this time because I got a few nuggets I want to drop on you. First of all, let me give a nugget to Donald Trump. Donald Trump, <clears throat> let me share something with you. We, and I'm talking about you and I, we are older men. And sometimes we're talking and forget what we were talking about. Sometimes we uh, say something and we're looking for a word to explain what we want to say. And that word is cross town somewhere. We can't find it to save our soul. But you know what? This is why when we have the opportunity to have help, when we have assistance, we have people who are aware, who are abreast of our thoughts and what our aims and our objectives are. So they can help us. In the event we're saying, making a statement about something, we forget what we were making that statement about. They can give us a cue. If we're looking for a word, they know what we're trying to say. They can bring that word up and remind us of what that word is. It's not that wrong to recognize that you get old. And when you get old, your words and other things in your mind sometimes just stop working just like down that does. It just stops. And sometimes, when if that stops, you go to the doctor, try to get some medication to help build it up. So it's the same thing with assistance. You've got to have faith in people other than yourself. Because just like you can't stop that thing from getting up, or getting, uh, from getting up, or <laughs> just like you are incompetent. What's the, what's, the, what's the expression? See, I'm trying to find that word right now. You see me? You know what I'm talking to say, right? Just like you can have ED, and you can't do nothing about that. You can stop thinking proper. But you can do something about that. Get you some help. Just like you go to the doctor to get some help for your ED. So, people will respect you if you act like you've got some sense and stop acting a fool like you're the only man in the world that got some sense. Now, that's the nugget for Trump. Now, the nugget for we the public, I want to say this to you. I listen to people commentate about Trump. If he just talked about his economic plan and stopped raising his head up about this and head up about that, then he could be doing good. No, he wouldn't. See, when you hear a person listen to Donald Trump lie, and you ask that person, did you, why did he lie like that? And that person says, Trump didn't lie. If you bring up a list of lies that have been documented that he told, and they say, that is not a lie. And you know you make the statements that this person who are, who are ignoring the facts, they are playing to one audience, and that's Donald Trump. Well, I want you also to know that Donald Trump is playing to an audience. And his audience that he's playing to, they're not the little 40% or 30% that supports him. No, he's playing for even a smaller audience. I don't know how many is in that group, but they are the group that you call the New World Order, the one who set dictators in different parts of the world, the one who sets economic plans for different countries. They, that's the one that he's playing for. So we need to stop talking uh, about Donald Trump like there's any possibility that you're going to get anything good out of Donald Trump. No, his economic plan wouldn't do nothing. It ain't about doing nothing. It's about giving you something to say other than just telling it like it is. Telling it like it is. When he says, and he says it quite often, the media is a fake. What's wrong with calling him the, a demon? Calling him demon Trump. Remind the nation that he's a demon. Remind the nation that he has nothing whatsoever to do with good. Remind the nation that he is what he is. And you can't make him into anything else but what he is. The sad story is that he's your president of the United States. And everybody in the United States should be ashamed except those that's playing to him. They are looking forward to Trump being placed in this country as a true everlasting dictator. And they want a position in his dictatorship to let him know that they will do exactly what they think he wants done. So, I hope you can take these nuggets and run with it. Till next time, Eddie Marcus say goodbye.